Pa evo, danas smo na prvom danu festivala Smokva, prvog regionalnog LGBTIQ i feminističkog festivala kojeg je inicirala lesbijska udruga Lori s kojom surađuju udruga Pariter, Centar za ženske studije i inicijativa Građanke svom gradu. Večeras inicijativa Građanke svom gradu ugošćuje američkog genderqueer umjetnika Krista Greja tako da evo sad iščekujemo da započme njegova predstava Body Dialectics. U predstavi Body Dialectics Kriz se zapravo referira na svoje iskustvo koje prolazi kao svoje iskustvo rodne tranzicije koju na neki način doživljava kao neku vrstu laboratorija za razotkrivanje rodne binarnosti kao društvenog konstrukta tako da zapravo vidjet ćemo rad koji je na granici isto tako života i umjetnosti. When I tell people that I'm non-binary, they're like, okay, well, what does that mean? And I'm like, well, I'm not really male or female. And they're like, you can't do that. Or my favorite thing, um, but what are you really? Really, this is it. Even when I tell people who I am, they still can't see me, and it's starting to be my experience that I, I can't be what I can't see. See? My name is Chris Gray, and I'm performing Body Dialectic tonight, which is a series of stories basically created for theater. All of the stories uh, are things that have happened to me, and everything that happens during the performance is really about questions that people have asked me over and over and over again. So in some ways it's really accessible. It allows people to be with the content that might be different or challenging, um, but let them in to see life from a perspective that might not be like their own. I remember this very clearly. I was like five years old. I probably had just started kindergarten or something like that. And we were sitting on the front steps of her house and my babysitter asked me, what do you want to be when you grow up? And I was like, easy, I want to be a boy when I grow up. <laughs> and she was like, yeah, um, not what I meant, doesn't really work like that. And also, you can't be a boy because you're a girl. Look at me now. <laughs> I think Rika is incredibly beautiful, and I'm only sorry that I'm here for such a short amount of time. I feel that my work is completely different when I get to travel with it. Mm -hmm. When I perform this work in the context of North America, uh, many of the things that I'm talking about are, are things that are happening there. When I get to travel the work and take it somewhere else, then we can start to build sort of communities of affinity around issues that people are experiencing in different places of the world. So I think it actually strengthens the work, and I think it's really, it's maybe one of my favorite things to do is to travel the work and bring it to new places. The registration was pretty easy. I listed my motorcycle. 1978 BMW R80 7. It was a match. The license, kind of a different story. Is this you? This doesn't look like you. Who is this? Okay, the, this doesn't look anything like you, actually. You have no hair, you've got a beard. Also, this says, is this someone else's ID? Did you steal this ID? This is wrong. Something's wrong. You know what? We ought to just arrest you. I'm having some issues with visibility. And actually, it's been an issue for a really long time. Like, as long as I can 